Today, I'll be attempting to break some of the most difficult Champions League records. There will be five records in five levels to this video. Starting with level one, which will be the easiest, working our way up to level five, which will be the most difficult record to beat. We have records for Champions League goals, hat tricks, red cards, and more, so stay tuned to see if I can beat these records. We're starting here in level one, and the record we're going to be attempting to break is the fastest scored goal in Champions League history. The current fastest goal in Champions League history was scored by a man named Roy McKay, who played for Bayern Munich when he scored a goal in only 10 seconds against Real Madrid in 2007. We'll be trying to avenge Real Madrid and score a goal in under 10 seconds with them. We're going to try to score this goal in 10 seconds in real life. Ignore the clock on the screen. This is attempt number one. As soon as the ball's kicked off, the timer will begin and 10 seconds to score. Can I do it on the first try? Let's see if we can just run through the whole team. Bang a shot. Nope. Saved. Now, since this is only level one, we are doing this on beginner difficulty and we'll have unlimited attempts to complete this challenge. All right, let's go. Second time is the charm. The 10 second timer is up. It is beginner difficulty. No one is defending. Please, four seconds. I'd have shoot from here. No, that would have been it. Attempt after attempt, the level one challenge was proving more difficult than I thought, but we finally completed Three seconds. it. Is this the one? Yes. Oh, we did it in under 10 seconds. It is the man, Rodrigo, who has just broken the record. With this goal, our first record has been complete. Rodrigo in approximately nine and a half seconds. And we're going to now move on to level number two. For this next record, we will be attempting to break the record. The most red cards in a single Champions League match. There are currently five games in Champions League history where there have been five red cards in a single match. So our goal is to get six. Now I'm going to start out controlling PSG because they have Sergio Ramos, who is the player with the most red cards. He has four in Champions League history but at some point in the video i'm probably gonna have to switch over to control bayern munich because we'll reach a red card limit i believe you can only get five red cards with one team in fifa the difficulty will slowly increase throughout this video as we're gonna do this challenge on professional difficulty and with a five minute half length we only get one attempt at this challenge let's try to get through with psg and through with bayern munich here we go so getting red cards i believe is a lot harder than it may seem because you end up just stealing the ball half the time Yes. Oh, he's not giving it. Come on, referee. All right, good start. We have our first yellow card, so we're halfway to our first red. It's messy. Here we go. I just need him to be through on goal. I think that's the easiest way. I keep stealing the ball. Stop. I want you to tackle his legs, not the ball. Woo. Yes. Oh, that's a red. That's going to be our first one. Come on. Stay down, Davies. Yep, Marquinhos. Get him out. Get him out. Straight red. That's one of six. <laughs> Oh, that's going to be a red. <laughs> we needed a replay of that tackle. <laughs> we didn't even have the ball. Messi's out. Two of six red cards after this. <laughs> what a tackle, Messi. I love it. Oh, wait. This could be a red. Is this our third? Okay. Ah, yellow. Oh, I've sent a man down in the box. Have we gone on? It got three. So dramatic. Only a yellow card. Come on, ref. You know you want to give that red. Ah, so I gave up a pen, and I, I don't even get the glory of a red card. Come on. Just look at all these cards I have at halftime. This is ridiculous. All right, that tackle should be our third. Yes, Nuno Mens. Okay, we're halfway there. I know I said I was going to switch teams to Bayern Munich. We will eventually, but we have so many more yellow cards with PSG. I'm going to try to finish this team off. And I think we've just received four. Fabian Ruiz is gone. Get him off. In the 60th minute, only 30 in-game minutes left to beat this record. Look at this team, though, right now. PSG has seven players on the field, including the keeper. And just like that, Neymar's gone. We have officially tied the record. That is five red cards. <laughs> Wait. That's it. PSG have forfeited due to the lock of players. Right. I needed to get three with... Oh, I needed to get a few with Bayern Munich. That record is tied. Level two, I guess, is is wrong. On to level three. So for this next record, we'll be trying to break the single season Champions League goal scoring record, which is currently held by Cristiano Ronaldo with... 
17 goals in one season. And I've upgraded Lionel Messi to a 99 overall to see if he can break Ronaldo's record. Now in career mode, unless you're actually controlling the players, I've never seen a player score 17 in one season. So we're gonna see if Messi can do it while being upgraded to 99 overall. And to do this, we simulate all the way to the end of the 2022-2023 season. Let's see if Messi can break this record. All right, so we made it to the end. We are in June 2023. Tottenham Hotspur have won the Champions League. No, and they beat Chelsea in the final. It's the worst sim I've ever seen, man. PSG also had an early exit to Real Madrid, so I don't think Messi's gonna be breaking any records anytime soon. Oh my God, Messi only scored six. A 99 rated Messi only scored six goals. Oh God, I guess I guess Ronaldo really is the goat after all. All right, that is three levels complete. We are one for three so far, and I'm not letting myself end this video until I complete at least three records, and we have the two hardest levels remaining. The record we're going to be attempting to beat is the most goals by one player in a single Champions League match. It's currently held by three players. Luis Adriano, Lionel Messi, and Erling Haaland have all scored five goals in one match and we're gonna join that list today but with a special player harry Maguire is going up front for manchester united and is gonna attempt to score five in one game yes Maguire, holland and messi's names are all gonna be next to each other in ucl history and i only have one attempt to do it with six minute halves on world-class difficulty objective in this game beat harry Maguire the ball Let's do it. Second time's the charm. Oh, Harry Maguire has the worst position. There's no wonder the man doesn't play striker. How about this? Oh, look, Casemiro's through, but I can't shoot with him. Passing it back. Maguire for his first. He scored it. Let's go. Get that ball. We don't have time. Stop. He's trying to score, but he's already scored. That is one of five. No. Six goals for Harry Maguire. Record is five, but we need to score six to break it. And that was 32 minutes in. At this rate... We're not even going to score three. But we have momentum. And Maguire's back on it. He's going to do a bit of passing here, man. He's no selfish player. Hold up. Yes, with his head. That was nowhere close. Yes. Oh, my God. Steal. Oh, it's a 1v2. Maguire, just find the positioning, and you're going to get an easy second. Yes. Come on. That's two, baby. Let's go. Oh, stop playing the guitar. We have, we'll have time to celebrate later, Maguire. That is two of six goals right before the end of the first half, meaning I now... Oh, what do I, I'm going to have to score four goals in the second half. Uh. Oh, they're fouling him now. They know. No. Is he injured? No. Okay, he's fine. I thought they're going to make me sub him off. <laughs> we failed the challenge like that. That would have been the worst way to go out here. Wait, we may get one more this half. Please, nope. Maguire. No, they're staying with the save. It's not over. Give it to him again. Pass it to Maguire. Come on. Come on. No. All right, second half. Four goals is doable. It is going to be very difficult, though. Go, Maguire. Yo, he's been sent in. He's so slow, but he might score it. No, Ter Stegen. We find Maguire's head. He's got a massive head. How can we not find his head? It's huge. Yo, he's got a bit of pace. Oh, my God, Maguire. Yo, he's so quick. Yeah. <laughs> why is he... Bro, why is he just got 99 pace out of nowhere? Look at this man. Just cut the corner and turn on the Jets. What a move. Nah, he can't do it twice in a row, can he? He's actually got wheels. Dude, this is this is insane. Four goals, Harry Maguire. He's one away from the record. He's got 99 pace out of nowhere. And he only needs two more to set the record. Now Luke Shaw is turning on the Jets now. He knows we're trying to accomplish this mission for Harry Maguire. And he's going to help make it happen. Here we go. Do we give this to this fat head? Do we bicycle kick? That was too good to be true. <laughs> only 15 minutes remain in this game. This is going to be so difficult to complete. But we're through. It's in the box, Hattie. 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 Five. It's five. He's gone on. He's tied the record. We have one more left. That score line down there. All those Maguire goals. That was beautiful. Bang one. The last goal. Yeah. Yeah. Maguire. The record has been set. Celebrated by falling into the goal. But that is it. Six goals in one game for Harry Maguire. And there it is. Match complete. Level four complete. It is time to move on to level five. It is time for the final record. The final level, level five. For this record, we will be competing on legendary difficulty. And we're going to set the record for becoming the first ever team in the Champions League to win a penalty shootout 
scoring panenkas only. And here we go. Let the shootout begin. We're controlling Real Madrid and we're facing Chelsea. And we're starting with the Panenka King himself, Kareem the Dream Benzema. All right. Just start us out with the goal. Hands off the controller. And he's done it. Benzema does not miss Panenkas. Now, here's the hard part. We have to score Panenka, but I have to make some saves with Courtois because we need to win this as well. Luka Modric. Now, I can aim these. I'm going to shoot this one. Right. Don't listen to me. Oh, he heard me. Keppa heard me. Mason mounts. Right. First save. Come on. We're still in it. And it is Alba. We're one for two on Panenkas. Down the middle seems to have worked best. And it continues working. Let's go. That is two Panenkas made. We need two saves now. Felix scores. Tony Cruz. Do I keep going down the middle? I feel like it's too risky at this point. Stop doing it. Cruz. Yes, it worked again. Come on, Courtois. We just need one more save, man. No. Dude, down the middle can't work again, can it? Or maybe it can. Nah, no way. No way, bro. No way. Courtois, we've scored all the Panenkas we needed. Just save this Reese James penalty. Come on. Go, on. Go he saved it with his feet. Yes, come on. On legendary difficulty, the final record has been broken. And the celebration begins. We have beaten the most difficult record. If you enjoyed this, click the watch the video where I go to the Champions League final and comment which records I should break next.